We're backstage at the Country Music Hall of Fame and Museum with Restless Heart. It's cooking out country. It's my favorite event. It's every Wednesday here at the Hall of Fame, and it's your first event. Tell us about the music you're going to play today. Well, um, we're celebrating our 28th year together. It's the original five guys, and, uh, and you know, the Hall of Fame, what an incredible place. And this, this is a cool event. I had some friends that have played it. And so they called and asked us what we did, and we said yes. So uh, we're really looking forward to it, and they've shown us all the, the wonderful things that are happening around here. We're really impressed. Well, you saw the Hall of Fame way back when it wasn't even in this building. You had a job, is that right, at the Hall of Fame? Yeah, in that little closet over there on the corner of 16th and DeMumbry. <laughs> Larry, <laughs> at one time, had a job. Yes. <laughs> now I'm semi-retired. Uh, well, that's why they call it playing music. It's, yeah. not, a, it's not like a, a regular job. Yeah, when I met Larry, uh, we were both going to Belmont, and Larry was working down here at the Country Music Hall of Fame as a stock boy. That job's still open, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be a lot tougher job today. That gift shop is gigantic. When she cries at night And she doesn't think that I can hear her She tries to hide All the fear she feels inside So I pray this time I can be the man that she deserves Cause I die a little each time When she cries This building, when you walk through these doors, uh, what does that do to you as an artist? What's your favorite exhibit? Who are you most inspired by? Well, I mean, it, it's overwhelming from where I came from. You know, it, it was just literally almost two rooms. You know the Elvis car and some, you know, and some clothes, and 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 now I mean they're they're doing performances down here. They're incorporating songwriters come down here and do you know corporate events and, and just selling the whole the idea of of the history of country music. It's, and I'm just proud of the place. I was just in the museum shop, and it is amazing in there that people need to go check that out. And they have a wall of gold and platinum records that. It's very reminiscent. Do they have ours up there? It's very reminiscent of Alan Jackson's living room. There's like literally eight hundreds of them. <laughs> <laughs> I want somebody, please, please tell me why does it have to be black or white? Why do we have to love one to love another? Well, oh, tell me why? Why does it have to be? Hey, okay, everybody put your hands together like this. Come on, everybody. Ashley, you want to sing this with us? No, you don't. Come on. Come on. Okay. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Keep your hands going. We want y'all to sing with us on this, okay? We've been singing for a while, ever. Let's hear you sing with us. Here we go. Don't it have to be my own? Why does it have to be my own? Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. Sing it out, Joe. Why? Well, tell me, why does it have to be wrong or right? Why does it have to be one way or the other? Won't somebody please, please tell me, why does it have to be black or white? Why do we have to love one to love another? Have a great afternoon, y'all.